I have two questions. Mm. One from a listening perspective. Mm. So when I have any itching in the body, I mm. can clearly see that I'm listening to my body. Mm. One, but when it's a thought level perspective, how will I know that I'm listening to me or I'm listening to my mind? Uh, listening, when you start itself, your mind will give way. It will be to you only. Mm. Next. And um, self-doubt uh, plus uh. self-hatred is nothing but a self-denial? No, 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 no. Sometimes it can be, but self-denial is a independently, completely, no possibility. It's like a ceiling you, by you. You putting the last nail on your own coffin is self-denial. Go ahead. Nityanandam Swamiji. Uh. Uh, so, I have one question that mm. when we remember the childhood incidents, mm. some of them are our own memories mm. and some are the memories uh, that others have and they share with us. Oh, when mm. you were a kid. No, even happened. that becomes yours. Once you feel one with it, it is yours. Okay, For okay. example, some terror movies, you yourself may not have seen the ghost, but you would have been so one with that movie that becomes, you, you want that as your own, you just swallow it. Yeah. So you complete with mm. both. You have to complete with that also. The terror movies you saw at the age of 4, 5, 7, 8, mm -hmm. which you just swallow it and make it as your own. Okay. How many of you have this kind of experience with these terror movies? <laughs> So horror I, movies. Mm. Yeah, I asked this question to a lot of people. And I wanted to tell this before we change the subject. I sincerely request, never ever spend time in watching horror movie, terror movie. It will directly damage your decision making mechanism. Whenever you find time, spend time with your, in watching the comedy scenes or comedy type of movies and even romance is okay. Those things does not damage your consciousness. I am not promoting romance. Don't go and put in the Facebook, Swamiji said watch romance movies. No. I am saying that doesn't damage your consciousness. But the horror movie directly damages your possibility for living enlightenment. Possibility for Advaita. And constantly agitates your inner space, which takes a lot of time for completion. So always the violence, horror, terrorizing those scenes, please avoid. And this recently one boy was killed by the tiger in the... Uh, Delhi Zoo, that video becoming uh, viral and watched by millions of people, I was so sad, not sad, sadness can never come into me, that is different, for your sense, in your language, I should say that it was so bad, that people should not be watching it, and See, nothing touches me. So, my case is different. But people should not be watching it because if you watch it, you will own it up. You, see, listen, listen carefully. You can never keep yourself separate from the scene. You will unconsciously put yourself in that scene and live the whole thing and create a pattern and incompletion, after that completing with, his, with it and getting out of it becomes a big headache. How many of you watched that video? Stupid. <laughs> honestly, people who watched the, watch it, raise your hand. How many of you honestly agree at least for a few minutes, you put yourself in that place and uh, visualized. Raise your hand. Is it required? Jnanatma is telling, she was seeing how to overcome the fear. That you should find out your earlier existing incompletions with fear and complete. Not that you will create one more incompletion and complete. 
you want to take bath to clean yourself so you will apply all the dirt on you and then go and take bath what a logic already you have enough why don't you go and wash what you have instead you will order for 2 kg dirt and apply on that and then go and take bath so i sincerely request all you guys never do this the stupid way of accumulating incompletions and patterns with which you will be suffering for quite a long time tell me how many of you were really upset after watching that then why did you watch <laughs> excitement curiosity is it required no you can always turn the other way try to see and the one of the worst problem is some of the simple acts through simple acts the incompletion you can accumulate stays in your system for 10 12 years and all 10 12 years and all you will be struggling with it that is why i am saying don't accumulate understand don't accumulate especially when you are trying to transform you spiritually see there are stupid fellows who are not going to do anything anyway let them see all these horror movie and die who cares <laughs> you understand they are they are not interested in any uh, peak possibility authenticity advaita or enlightenment reality and all that let them get lost but you guys your lives are very precious because you are all the possibility hope for the future the moment you become a seeker and started seeking the ambition spiritual ambition of the whole cosmos is waiting for you to flower understand now you are pregnant with that spiritual possibility you can't be afford you can't afford to abort yourself cosmos can't afford to abort you you are a great possibility that is why i am telling the moment a person starts seeking something beyond his sense the moment he feels inspired by the advaita or spiritual ideas now he is no more ordinary human being he needs to be protected guided raised and delivered as a baby never aborted you understand so do not allow the conscious abortion and this tiger video will not just sit with you is a as a uh, horror or anxiety it will start even feeding your impossibility pattern you understand see whenever you face your spouse you will be sitting like that same boy that visualization will overpower you i'm just making very jovially i'm telling spouse but i am not not just the, whether your boss or any situation any any situation where you feel powerless you will visualize that boy's powerlessness just one person with a spontaneous intelligence in that in that area one match box and one shirt and drop it near that boy that would have enough to scare the tiger away stone will not scare the tiger it will agitate fire will scare the tiger now only all of you thinking oh god such simple solution you don't need a god you don't need anything just spontaneous intelligence one person who was shooting in that area one match box one shirt is enough to save that boy everyone got into that panic mood that is why 15 minutes the tiger gave time for him he was not angry
that's all you need i can be sure many would have had lighter and matchbox everyone was having a shirt one shirt one matchbox burn it and throw it to that boy if that boy waves that that's enough let me please be honest when you watched that video how many of you had this click this would have been the solution that is why i am telling making yourself more and more into the impossibility why should we as if we have less karma and we call please bring it why see whenever you go to the impossibility the visual images you collected about the persons who are in the impossibility that will be repeated and it will become like a psychological chain for you to fall into that powerlessness and non action just scan yourself subtly and see how many of you when you fall into the impossibility you visualize the scenes of impossible beings persons who have seen in your life repeating in you raise your hand it's a very subtle now you are adding material to that bank are you getting it you are adding material to your wrong bank all of you understood now please put your question i'll answer your question hmm. swami ji in my case i watched the censored version of the video so, so see what i am saying whether you watched the censored or not if you have censored it without allowing in your inner system that's enough and never watch the horror movies and uh, the terrorizing movies keep it out of your system Uh, Swami ji, yes. about completion. Mm. So I had this doubt: mm. being complete about an incident, mm. is it when you wake up in the morning you've mm. forgotten that incident, or mm. that incident still exists but it is you don't become powerless? What I am saying, the incident still exists, you don't become powerless is the one level. After some time, you may not even remember it. Okay. It will go to that extreme. So that comes with mm. time. Yes, in time. Okay, and one more question. Mm. So about listening to your pain. Mm. So we had this uh, mm. many views in our mm. team. Mm. Someone said that say if your ankle is hurting, mm. so you listen to the pain. The mm. moment you listen to the pain, mm. it vanishes. Mm. And someone said that you ignore it. Mm. Don't listen. So no, no, no. Listening is the right thing. You Not listen ignore. to it. Yes, yes. And focus on it, and it yes. goes. Okay. Thank you. Please go ahead. Swami ji, I have two questions. One is related to this incident. Mm. That why people are so interested in such things? Uh, because I am calling because ten no, people. Because no, people enjoy pain. Why? People enjoy being in powerless. Why? You, I have to ask you, not you to me. I don't enjoy. Come on, you are only enjoying. I have to ask you, why are you enjoying? Okay. <laughs> What is this? You are asking me why? <laughs> you are only enjoying. I only have to ask you. Oh, so we you can get into their system and find out right <laughs> self denial self denial okay. self denial people enjoy the, even their failures sympathy which comes through their failures and you don't know why people enjoy sometimes stupid things and still i am not able to understand why people drink alcohol how will that be of any help but people enjoy what to do why this is not exciting i mean this program <laughs> because i am calling 10 people maybe uh, they, you have to have a little taste of it for it to for you to experience excitement mm -hmm. and moreover the way you are calling maybe bulldozing and not in the from the completion space to prove you are some way superior and all that condescending it may be mm -hmm. okay. there is a possibility for that mm -hmm. and another question is uh, mm. my wife and my mother uh, continuously fighting indian so daughter in law mother in law what to do that nothing can be done still i am not found the solution for that so 
<laughs> Any other problem you have, tell me. <laughs> Is it my incompletion? <laughs> Is it my incompletion? I can say it starts from you. Starts from you. Starts from you. Okay. So after I get enlightened, they will not fight. No, no, no. You don't need to go up to the level of enlightenment. Even if you become complete, they will not fight. Oh. Okay. Mm. Mm. Or I'll be able to resolve their issues. Is it? No, no, no. Even if you become complete, the power of your completion will be so much. They both will simply be start getting complete. So fight will stop or simply fight will stop and they will become complete with each other. You will miss the soap show every day goes on in your house. You may have, you may need TV for your entertainment <laughs> instead of live show. Come on. <laughs> Swamiji, I have one situation where when I did the completion, I went to other lives. Mm. Then um, this has been a big problem, this particular situation. Mm -hmm. And I found two lives and relived them. Mm -hmm. But still, it seems like the problem is not complete. So sh how far back does this go? No, no, no. You see, the prob your problem is you do not listen to me, Ma. Yeah. If I tell you your problem, you are not going to listen. Mm. Even if I tell you you don't listen to me, you will only get hurt. Uh. You are not going to plan to listen to me. Oh. That is why I did not give you a direct answer even yesterday. You did give direct answer. I got it. No. Oh, I just it was helpful. I just pacified you and sent you. Oh. That much only you are ready to listen from me. Uh. You are not ready to listen a direct answer from me. Oh. Then you are suffering with a deep self-denial. This is the direct answer. Uh. You need to work on that. And Understand? Yes. In no way you need to change others. Uh. You have to change completely only you. Mm. You are not ready to listen to this answer. So uh. I just pacified you and sent you yesterday. Uh. That is why you are thinking I gave you the right answer. Uh. Yesterday what I gave you is the consolation. Today what I am giving is the solution. Okay. What you want, take it. Next. Mm. Uh. While writing the patterns, listing mm. the patterns, mm. in one incident, mm. like I have encountered several patterns. Mm. Is it possible like... Yes. In one incident can be the totality or the root of several patterns. Yeah. Thanks. Anybody else with question can come forward? Mm. Yes. Actually, I have to See, this, this answer is for every one of you. All of you understand? These answers are for every one of you. Actually, I had the same question. You already answered that, mm -hmm. Swamiji. Mm -hmm. And uh, one comment for Sonika. Mm -hmm. You asked about the pain and uh, no other example, better example can be given as the Gurukul kids. Mm -hmm. Yesterday, I saw two of them. Mm -hmm. One injured there, his thumb between the door and the door jam. And she came to me with the thumb and I checked her. I perceived there was a fracture, I sent her for x-ray. Mm. And I told her to have some medications or ice packs. She said, we don't take medications. I will just focus and complete and the pain will go. <laughs> and once Ma came back with the x-ray, showed me the x-ray, there was no fracture. And she said she is moving without pain. And it's not that we deny medication, understand? We provide all the medical care. It if they feel pain, immediately we provide. Mm. It was she who said, I don't want medications. Mm. I know I can get rid of the pain by focusing. Mm. Probably a 9, 10-year-old kid. Mm. Nothing more than that. Thank you. Swami, I'm a bit confused about the answer you gave. Uh. When my wife... Wi wife and mother, mm. when they have incompletion with together, mm. what way I am related to that? Please listen. You did not show the power of completion, possibility, what completion can bring to the life to them. That is why they are in that same mood. Why she listens to me, not to you? Because I show the possibility. That's 
<laughs> yes. Mitran Musulji. Mm. Uh, I have one question. Uh, I recently had this incident with my father where I wanted to explain completion to him and I wanted to complete with him during LAP. Mm -hmm. And he said that uh, I know all this, I, I don't want to listen to this. Mm -hmm. So uh, I was then a bit confused and in low mood. And like, how should I take responsibility? No, no, no. For no. Tell him, you know, uh, forget about this completion and all. Have some mood and situation where, like a family dinner, that kind of a situation, you tell him it is not some spiritual practice or anything. I wanted to have some psychological relief for me, so I wanted to speak to you something. So in that context, if you op uh, uh, speak, you may open his listening. Okay. See, the moment he thinks you are trying to do some spiritual process with him, <laughs> that's it. Oh, this fellow is already mesmerized by Nityananda, <laughs> and Nityananda teaches how to mesmerize people, and this fellow is mesmerized me. You understand? <laughs> and that fear, you may need to open up, relax him, and bring the space of listening, and with, with a little, you understand? Yes. See, the, what media has done, you have to undo. Hmm. That's what. See, most of our devotees, relatives are afraid of our devotees. How many of you experienced this? <laughs> they think you are an alien. <laughs> Understand? You are an alien and you have gone cuckoos, crazy, whatever you want. <laughs> you call, you are given all kinds of names, you are given all kinds of titles, you are given all kinds of... <laughs> But you are never listened. You understand? This is such an unfortunate thing happening. See, one thing you guys also need to understand. It took so much of my time and energy to give you guys the cognitive shift. So you can't expect them to have even sympathy towards you unless you spent little time with them. You understand? How much I have to come down to you to entertain you for you to open your listening to me. Understand? And see, it is the tremendous friendliness I radiate with you and the story you listen from others about my friendliness, that opens you up to listen to me. See, it, it is never my powers makes you open to listen to me. It is the story about my friendliness. How many of you understand this? <laughs> it is the stories about my friendliness that makes you open up to listen to me. That gives you the comfort to listen to me. So you need to do that to them. Understand? That kind of a comfort zone, only then you can expect them to even listen to you. You can't be condescending. Condescending way, never the truths are transmitted. Condescending way, I can establish I am God. But only with friendliness, I can establish you are God. The purpose is to establish you are God. You understand? I am God, I don't even need to establish. Come on, what is there? I am God, I know that. <laughs> the whole process is to establish you are God. That is where the whole work is. That is where the need for the Sangha, enriching, whole thing. You understand? Just if I sit under the banyan tree and don't care about anything and show only my miracle powers, go on healing and materializing, enough for to establish that I am God. You understand? If I just do that job, my branding will be only that and we will have millions here. The moment I ask you to transform, only crowd disappears. If I just sit 
and do materialized vibhuti and kumkum and give boons, heal people. Only that job and only that is established as my brand. Do you know the amount of crowd we will have here? But unfortunately in that crowd all of you will be lost. I sacrifice that crowd for all of you. <laughs> Understand? I sacrifice that crowd for all of you. Because I want to sit with you guys who want to experience that Advaita. Who want to make this as part of life, lifestyle. So for this, the whole game is different. First of all, I, you need to have the tremendous trust and friendliness with me. I have to make you experience my space is approachable. You can play in my space. My space can be your play place. Like McDonald's play place. You can go up and jar. You can do this. You can go inside and come out. Uh, the McDonald's play place you have seen? One circle will be there, one straight will be there, one plant will be there. You can play on that, you can play on this, you can jump on this, you can jump on that. By mistake you can even do one, two, three once in a while, it's okay. You will not be scolded for it, you will not be punished for it. Now if a child does a one, two, three in the play place, nobody is going to punish him for that. So that level of comfort zone, I will have to create for your space for you to listen. Whether it is my jokes or casual comments or my likes in the Facebook or love you comments in the Facebook. <laughs> Understand, everything is the smell of my friendliness. It's the smell of my being. The smell of the Advaita. That gives you the comfort zone to play, to jump up and down, to pick up Advaitic truths. Understand? <laughs> Big job. <laughs> Come on. Go ahead. Swamiji, I found uh, two characteristics in me majorly. Mm. Uh, one, uh, I always avoid responsibility that mm. you told mm. like it's uh, self-doubt. Mm -hmm. The other thing I see is I never want to fail. Mm. So beca because of that, mm. I just don't want to take up anything. Mm. So I, I, mm. I don't even try anything. Mm. So mm -hmm. what under what? I, this think, comes uh, I think this comes under self-denial. You will have to complete with this pattern. Pen down the incidents when you decided to take the responsibility but badly failed. That is where it starts. If you find the route, you can complete it. Uh, so Swami In my case, you. if I start 100 and succeed in 10 and not succeed in 90, if I want 100 success, I start 1000 or 10,000, that's all. <laughs> because I know the 10% success rate. So I wanted 100 means, let's do 10,000. That's all. <laughs> Don't all the time think and speak about this 90 not happening. See the statistics, 10 happening. Then now you know the law of life. If you want 100, make it 10,000. Over. <laughs> Come on. Swamiji, I wanted to know, so say if the addiction level is mm. really high mm. for a person who's not done inner awakening, mm -hmm. doesn't know the mm. actual crux of completion, mm. so say for a two-day program, mm. when the addictions are overpowering mm. your listening, mm. so then what is the simplest start to completion that you can do? I know your problem, I'll directly attend to it. Don't worry, go. Next. Nityanandam Swamiji. That only can be attended by the mystical powers. I'll do it. <laughs> a, uh, for me, it's a peculiar uh, suffering uh, pain. Uh, 
when my children are with my wife, they are uh, nine years and six years. Every uh, uh, fortnight, uh, weekends, they'll two hours, they'll meet me. Mm. But she spread all the bad about me. Uh, and in the two hours, mm. uh, if they tell something, daddy, mommy is telling mm. about you like this mm. and all. Mm. So how to convince... Maybe, no, no, maybe, uh, you accusing her is not going to turn your, make your kids understand. The space you carry for your kids only is going to convince your kids. I tell you, kids are so intelligent. They will start seeing who is poisoning them. They may tell you what mom told, but they themselves may not believe it. It's like many people come and tell me, we watch the channels to see, but we don't believe what they say. Understand? Yes. So the space you carry will make them understand what you are. Yes. Carry the space with courageous way. In the two hours I can make by fortnight clean that space. In the two hours you can clearly show how you respond to those accusations and tell the kids don't be poisoned by what she says and I don't want to poison you guys by telling something about her. That will give them the click. Thank you. Thank you, you guys need both of us. We might have separated due to our incompletions but you guys need both of us. Don't be poisoned about each other by each other. That will never think kids are small. They may be small, but they are not simple. Yes. Recently you said uh, do more projects and you know, expand. Instead mm. of 10, mm. you do 100. Mm. Uh, there the obstacles I get it. Most of the time when I left something and take another one, mm -hmm. Is it I am not saying left, leave something and take another one. All the hundred should be in your list, which you should be scanning day and night. <laughs> your vision. All the hundred should not leave your vision. You may be acting, may not be acting, but it should be in your table memory. But something goes into the backdrop, so that no, I am leaving... If uh, you if you just keep the work list and take care, nothing goes into backdrop. If I focus on one, other has to go to backdrop. No, that is the wrong belief you have about you. What That's the wrong inner image you have about you. If I focus on one, the other has to go to the backdrop, is one of the wrong beliefs you have about you. Complete with that, I can manage the whole and more okay. is the truth. Okay. Start putting your hands. Now if you think you can manage two, you will see you can manage ten. That will give you the confidence to manage hundred. But our personal involvement has to be there which gives an excitement. And please understand, can you, you saw my life last few days. Do you see anything is put in the backdrop? Priority shifts but never gone into... Uh, huh? Priority may shifts but not gone into backdrop. That's all. Okay. That's all. So, so how... All right. Okay. When you sat with me and spent that one day, did you see the amount of vast memory with which I am handling things? That we don't... <laughs> no. It is the... You see, the memory loss is one of the biggest incompletion we created, believing that we can't handle that amount of memory. Okay. So, so the first level of completion need to be done. We can handle any amount of memory. Our inner space is not a limited mall as we think. See, it is like some of the major incompletions, if you complete itself, you will have so much inner space to handle vast memory. So memory 
So restriction is one of the... See, it's just like computer only. If you have high resolution, you can store only two, three picture. Mm. If you make everything into Word document, you can store any amount. Correct. That's all. The high resolution and Word document, what is the difference, you know? Mm. The incompletion loaded to the information. Little incompletion loaded into the information. Correct. Is the high resolution. Okay. If you just pull the incompletions out of that... Uh, file, it will just become a word document. Oh. Thank you. Clear? Uh, and Swamiji. Uh, Swamiji, I have some And I am not IT engineer, by the way. Mm. Uh, I have some doubts regarding completion process, mm. Swamiji. Mm. Today we had a talk with the two kids, uh, Sundreshara and Jnana Prakasha. Mm -hmm. Yana Prakasha was telling, Sundareshara was, uh, he's often hitting me. Mm. But I know very clearly Sundareshara never does that out mm. of incompletion or uh, mm. no mm. hidden agenda behind him. Mm. Anything he does, it only enriches the other person. That much I'm very confident. Mm. But I, I didn't get uh, why this boy is feeling like that. What I am saying, the perception of Yana Prakasha has not yet evolved. So we should not allow Sundareshara even to hit for the right reason. Yeah, okay. We should tell Sundareshwara, till he, sta he also feels the confidence about your intention, don't hit him. Okay. I asked this question directly to him, Sund mm. Sundareshwara. Mm. Sundareshwara, if he does anything from the space of completion... No, no, no. What I am saying, mm. sometimes the other person not evolving also should be taken into consideration. He asked me some questions, Swamiji. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, I asked this doubt also to him. Mm -hmm. If anybody mm -hmm. talks anything mm -hmm. from the space of completion, will mm -hmm. it hurt the other person, even mm -hmm. if he use some angry words? And then what I am saying, it is true. I don't think Sundareshra has evolved to that level of completion. And he mm -hmm. asked me, uh, Swamiji, did that you is complete what? He has not evolved to the level of completion where he can advaitically transmit that. He even I use discretion. You understand? Yes. Even I use discretion. It is not that everyone gets firing from me. Even though it directly heals and transforms the person, it's not. Even I use discretion. Maybe it's my I look at him as a big boy. That's mm. the reason that I is not exaggerate. The no, you exaggerate. I exaggerate. Mm, that's true. But every time the answer what he gives, it's, it's like amazing. It that is to say, he is surely much more than his age. But you are trying to put an enlightenment on him, which is not yet. So wait. Yes, no, uh, <laughs> I have one more doubt, Swamiji. He mm. asked me, did you complete with your mother? Mm. I guess, yes, I completed with my mom. Mm -hmm. He said, no, you did not complete with your mom. Mm -hmm. If you are complete with your mom, mm. we will not feel like this. The two kids they will not feel no, like this. That, will is, be that is not completely that thing. It can be, it is one logic. It is one logic. But he needs to understand the Jnana Prakasha need to evolve a little more to understand Sundareshwara's aim and the context. So he has to wait. Sometimes when we are doing this completion process, Swamiji, mm -hmm. again and again the same memory comes. Mm -hmm. Again we complete. Again we go through. Sometimes no, we No, it means you retha, you remembered, not relived. Yesterday I got the same clarity, mm -hmm. Swamiji. Mm -hmm. uh, so this so is what... reliving is required, not remembering. But on the incident, we are not able to then, remember. Then... Uh, 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 do completion with a mirror, with that overwhelming emotion, without an incident. Day before yesterday, I spoke about it. Yes, exactly, Swamiji. Do that. Thank you, Swamiji. Please go ahead. Swamiji, mm -hmm. uh, while doing the SDHD thing, mm -hmm. I could not find any self-hate in me. Like I got self-doubt, mm -hmm. self-denial, those mm -hmm. things I got. But in self-hate, I Maybe you'll have cannot, to cannot sit and think a little more, then you'll get it. Because uh, SD, SD cannot exist without SH. Self-denial cannot exist. Self-denial and self-doubt is there means there will be self-hatred. Uh, but self-hatred is like me going out trying to come. No, no, no. Uh, let me give you the simple example. Like uh, if you are, somebody is sick, he thinks he may, whether he will get cured or not, self-doubt. If he thinks for all he has done, the lifestyle he lived, he, he should not get, he should not get well. He is not worthy of that. Self-hatred. And he comes to the conclusion he will not get all right. Self-denial. 
second one is self hatred means for all the things he has done he will not get well yeah understand i am i am justifying that okay how the I how the logic evolves from s d h d mm, but for as the uh, uh, self hatred i i just cannot come up with because so you may have to look a little deeper that's all just because you have not hit it don't think it is not there it's there but i've never tried to portray myself in front of someone even though they may not be convinced as something i'm not i mean i may be, if if they are perceptive enough to see the the real me fine whatever i may not make any extra effort to hide that fact from them so that is what i have basically done my whole most of my life basically uh, i didn't have any reason not to do that because that's been my life so when it comes to self hatred i i never i don't recall any situation where you know somebody knew more about me than i was portraying to them that sort of a way. even now i can see you are trying to show yourself as somebody who you are not to me to impress me that may be denial oh my my part no, self denial the gap from where the sh is going to happen not s oh okay but incident just not coming to me like that the self doubt self denial okay those things clearly now now yeah, what you, you did see where all you did <laughs> I wanted to ask you about memory because you said memory is infinite. We can hold as much memory as we want. Mm -hmm. So, for those of us that are teaching memory classes, mm -hmm. uh, last year you spoke about a sage mm -hmm. that knew everything. Mm -hmm. Then they brought him a shoe. Mm -hmm. A shoemaker brought him a shoe mm -hmm. because he had never seen one and asked him how to make the shoe. Mm -hmm. And he did some sign, mm -hmm. and the shoemaker said, "Yes, now mm -hmm. you know." But the Shankara. next day he didn't remember. Yes, sir. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Next day he didn't remember. And what you said was the way you know everything mm -hmm. is you don't store it. Mm -hmm. You just call it when it comes when it's important. But what I am saying, the state I am saying can be achieved just by completion okay. with your memory loss patterns. So then it can be stored. Yes. The storage is infinite. Uh, see, storage is infinite. Ah, mm. ah thank you. Yes. Mm. Please go ahead. Since last many years. Uh. I am suffering badly with cervical uh, spondylitis uh, problem, and I oh. and I got a very strong bl blessing also, and uh. I have very deep faith. Uh. I am doing completion also. Mm. Where I am missing Swamiji because still I am facing this issue and. Uh, I'll heal it. Don't worry. Thank you very much. I bless you all. Let's all radiate with integrity, authenticity, responsibility, enriching and causing eternal bliss. Nityananda. Nityananda Dhyana Peetam, Nityananda Nagar, off Mysore Road, Bidadi, Bengaluru. Phone 080-2727-9999. www.nityananda.org. www.youtube.com slash Lifebliss Foundation.